and Canadian Dean Gunnarsson attempts what is without any doubt the greatest escape in history at Hoover Dam. So turn off the lights and find a hand to hold. This is the world's most dangerous magic. deep inside one of the world's largest structures, Hoover Dam. It's cold and it's dark in here. It's like a crypt or a mausoleum. And it reminds me that I don't want my name added to the list of 96 people who died while they built this thing. Three million cubic yards of concrete. That sounds pretty impressive. But what's really impressive is 726 feet. That's the distance I'll fall if I make just one mistake. No one has ever attempted an escape like this before. They're gonna lock me up in a straitjacket and then swing me out over one of the highest dams in the world. I know it sounds like a crazy idea, but I was trying to think of a way to make the Houdini straitjacket escape more dangerous. And then I saw this guy at the circus, hanging by his toes from a trapeze, motionless and still. And I thought if you took and you combined the two ideas together, that would be dangerous. Ah! Up, up, up. It's taking all the strength away from my shoulders into my feet and my ankles. Ah! Ah! Okay, I think I'm slipping. Watch. Oh. oh! It's kind of like Houdini meets Evil Knievel. Don't go anywhere. You've never seen anything like it, ever. the challenge at Hoover Dam. Once again, I'm gonna be locked inside the triple-stitched, reinforced, regulation canvas straitjacket. I'm then gonna place my toes and hang from this trapeze, and the trapeze is gonna be swung out over the dam, 726 feet in the air. I'm ready. Since the days of Harry Houdini, performers great and small have been trying to increase the challenge of the straitjacket escape. You right? Who knows? Okay, We believe that tonight you will witness the greatest straitjacket escape in history. As you can see, his feet are not strapped down. All right, let's okay. go. go, go, go. Hanging this way causes almost unbearable leg pain. This is either very brave or very crazy.
my legs. <sighs> Careful, get me down. Let it go!